Hey guys, welcome back to another part of Let's Play The Sims 3 Generations. In today's part, I am finally beginning my rotational gameplay with the Myers family. As you guys can see by this lovely photo, the first household we are visiting is Jace, Flora, and their triplets. I'm really excited to get into this rotational gameplay with the Myers family because I miss them so much and I've been very curious to know what their lives have been like since we've been more focused on the triplets in university. So with this rotational gameplay style, my plan is to play with Jace and Flora for the first half of this video and then I'm going to switch back to the triplets because they have to go back to university for the the second term. In the last part, I told you guys that I would allow the triplets to take a break before returning back to university, but since I played a few days off camera, it's about that time for them to go again so that they can finish their degrees. Anyways, Jason and Flora are officially house owners. They just moved into a brand new house after living with Sienna and Quentin for many years. As a celebration, I'm going to have Jason and Flora throw a small housewarming party and a birthday party for their triplets because their birthday is today. Time really does fly in The Sims, and I can't wait to see what the triplets will look like along with how they're personalities will be like. And finally, like I mentioned earlier, once I switch back to the OG triplets, they will be sent off to university for another term. But like always, let's just get right into the gameplay. Before y'all express your questions and concerns for me in the comment section, I just want to inform you guys that I'm currently getting over a cold. So if I sound like a 45 year old man with nasal congestion, I apologize in advance. The nostalgia I'm having right now is unbelievable. It has been a very long time since we've been around Jace, Flora, and their triplets. So I am going to refresh everyone's memory on each sim individually with their sim information because I had recently made some adjustments. And just to throw it out there, there may be a lot of readjustments with my sims throughout this series because I want everything to fall in line with the sim itself and their storyline. Flora Norwood Myers. She is a young adult. She currently has 35 days left until she becomes an adult. She is an Aquarius. Her traits are hates to outdoors, social butterfly, clumsy, light sleeper, and computer whiz. In season one of Generations, she used to have the animal lover trait, but I decided to get rid of it because she never gave me that type of person. Her favorite music is kids, her favorite food is grilled cheese, and her favorite color is aqua. Lastly, her lifetime wish is to be super popular. I also went ahead and changed her lifetime wish because before it was Animal Rescuer and I never realized how difficult it would be to have her complete it. So since she is a social butterfly, I gave her a more easier lifetime wish like super popular since she is a social person. Here's Flora's relationships. She has a good bond with the whole Myers family and has a couple of friends. Flora is now unemployed. In season one of Generations, she had a career as a game developer, but since she had triplets, I decided to have her become a stay-at-home mom since three kids is a lot to handle. And honestly, I could see Flora being a stay-at-home mom with a hobby on the side to help contribute funds to the household. Surprisingly, Flora does not have any skills and no lifetime happiness rewards. Jace Myers. I didn't change anything with Jace, but like I said earlier, I want to refresh everyone's memory. He is a young adult. He currently has 35 days left until he becomes an adult. He is a Leo. His traits are shy, loves the outdoors, family oriented, eco-friendly, and loves the cold. His favorite music is geek rock. His favorite food is a hamburger and his favorite color is seafoam. Lastly, Jace's lifetime wish is surrounded by family. Here's Jace's relationships. It is very similar to Flora's except for the friends part because since he is shy, it's harder for him to make friends. Jace is still employed at the military base. He is level two in his career, which is a mess hall server. He works from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. on Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, and earns 44 simoleons an hour. Jace's skills and he does not have any lifetime happiness rewards as well. Finley Myers, he is a baby. Today is the triplets birthday, so we will be celebrating that in combination with the housewarming party. He is a Gemini along with the rest of his siblings. His traits are artistic and friendly. His favorite music is pop. His favorite meal is stew surprise, and his favorite color is violet. Felix Myers, his traits are loves the outdoors and virtuoso. His favorite music is country. His favorite meal is spaghetti and his favorite color is spice brown. Last but not least, Phelan Myers. Her traits are clumsy and light sleeper. Her favorite music is roots. Her favorite meal is mushroom omelet and her favorite color is lime. Now it's time for a house tour. This house was not built by me. However, it is fully decorated by your girl. You guys know I'm an interior designer. Anyways, when you first come into the house, there's an entrance or shall I say the foyer. To the left, we have a bathroom. Over here is the kitchen. 
Then we have the living room with the dining room all in one. I hate making living rooms, but this has to be one of my favorite living rooms I've made so far. Here is Jace and Flora's bedroom along with their study room. And lastly, here is the triplets bedroom. Y'all don't understand the excitement I have just to press play. Every time I play with Generations, it feels like home. This has to be one of my comfort series. Anyways, it is currently a Sunday morning. Jason and Flora are chilling, watching some TV. I hate to interrupt their quality time, but I'm gonna have Jace throw this house party soon. I'm gonna have him invite family only because they both don't have a lot of friends and I don't want to overwhelm Jace since he is extremely shy. Not them talking about another baby and it's crazy because I don't know if you guys peeped in the introduction they both wish to have another child and they just had these triplets I mean I know they're going to be toddlers but they don't have enough space to add on for another baby and I feel like it's too early I feel like they should wait until the kids are at least children and then have another one I know it's going to be like a crazy age gap but it just sounds right it sounds good and since Jace is getting a little hungry I'm going to have Flora serve him up something maybe some brunch like let's do waffles I shouldn't even have them eating anyways because I don't know when I'm going to throw this party but He's probably not going to be hungry for later, but let me go ahead and have him throw this house party. Why am I lagging? Hold on. I just cleaned this save file, but it is pretty old. So come on, Jace. Y'all like their makeovers? I hope you guys do. I did a lot of changes with almost everyone except for Quentin, Sienna, and Quinn, which I will do very, very soon. All right, we're going to do a house party. I would do birthday party, but like I said, this is going to be a housewarming party and a birthday party. So all in all, house party. I want to aim for a party at 3 p.m. I feel like that's a good time for everyone to get settled and notified. For the dress code, we're going to keep it simple. It's just going to be casual attire. And he's only going to invite over family. I hope the OG triplets don't bring any drama or chaos to this party. We're here for a good time, not a long time. So Alec, Briella, oh, let's, yeah, let's invite over Dahlia. Quinn, Quentin, Rylan, and Sienna. I think that's everybody, right? That should be everybody, yes. That is everyone. So let's go ahead. The party will start at 3 p.m. I'm excited. All right, Jace wants to throw a great party. Let's go ahead and lock that in. Let me see if Flora wants to. Oh, I'm surprised you don't really care because you're the social butterfly here. He's just here for a good time, not a long time, like I said. All right, oh, he's gonna go get one of the babies. I think, I can't really see in that small behind icon. I think that's the girl. Is that Phelan? Let me figure her name. Yeah, that's Phelan. Y'all look at their little makeovers. They looked completely different in season one. Here's Phelan. Here's, listen, I don't know. They all look the same. I'm gonna assume that is Felix. And this is Finley. Am I right? No, oh, that's Felix and the other boy was fin Finley. Please, I was close enough. They all look, <laughs> they look too too much alike. All right, what are you about to do? Oh, you're gonna hold Phelan and check on Felix. That is so cute. I love this mod. I love it. I'm here for it. But let me see what their needs are looking like. They're looking good. I mean, they all need a little bit of social except for baby girl. So we're going to put her back in a crib and I'm going to have him snuggle him and talk to him while lovely Flora is making him some breakfast. Yo, I got the cake ready for when the party starts and stuff. But I know I need three cakes, but I'm going to just do one cake at a time because I don't want too much going on since it's a very small house. Oh gosh, she burnt the waffles, but it's okay because we're still going to tear it up. We're going to eat it up. I need some suggestions. Since Flora is going to be this stay-at-home mom, what hobby can you guys see her doing? I was thinking maybe she could do painting, but she's a clumsy person. I think those paintings would look real busted. Maybe she could even do hacking because she is a computer whiz and computer whizzes can hack to earn simoleons. But definitely let me know what you guys think. That'll be lovely. So she is going to play some video games since her knees is looking good. Jace is eating these burnt waffles. I actually feel bad now, so I'm going to go ahead and dispose those waffles. Flora, you could try again next time, honey. Or actually, I'm just going to have him cook since he is level three in the cooking. Order a pizza. No, we're not going to order a pizza because ordering pizza in The Sims 3 is a complete scam. You might get your pizza and you might not get your pizza. And since it is a house party, his family might bring over food. Yo, I just realized... Oh my God, the little details. I never realized this. She has like a little, a mic. That is so cool. Did you guys know that? I think it's because her nerd is level nine. Cause I don't think Jace can do that unless it's because she's playing video games online. That is so cool. I actually want to get her into tournaments too because I know Sims could do that and probably earn money. I don't know. That'd be dope to see her do. Uh, yeah, do your dish. And I want to see if 
oh gosh i was gonna make him play video games with her but he gotta take care of these babies i mean she do too so but he was near them so i'm gonna um give a bottle oh jace oh the party is starting soon it's only one o'clock and they better not be here that's early i gotta take care of these kids first i'm gonna have her help him and breastfeed the babies to make the process go by faster because they need a bottle i do not want them crying or doing anything crazy when the party is beginning wait let me see if anybody's here okay yeah no nobody's here yet oh and let me do something real quick since he's gonna be the the main person in and out the house a lot make this his preferred vehicle all right are you good they're good they're gonna like poo or pee themselves but they'll be they'll be fine they're gonna be aged up by then all right, and you need to use the bathroom before these folks start coming in and hogging the house. I'm going to turn on the radio so we can... Oh, the radio's already on. You already know what the deal is, but let me unmute it since I always have this stuff muted. Y'all know the radio will be loud. And y'all know when Sienna get up in here, she's going to run to the radio and start dancing. So let me make sure I have her favorite station on. Oh, he has geek rock for himself. That's cute. Hmm, let me do pop today. That's a good volume, too. I don't like the song, but that's a perfect volume. I don't want to blast our ears out. All right, yes, girl, use the bathroom. Um, It's raining. No, 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 no. We're not going to drop my frames today. No lag spikes tonight. <laughs> All right, she's going to mess with the baby some more. Ooh. Actually, we're not going to spend any money. You know, you guys are rich, but save money, live better. You need to use the bathroom, too. So, Oh, and clean that. Actually, I'm going to change that. I don't want to hear that. Oh, my goodness. See, this is why I don't touch nothing. <laughs> Let's skip it again. I'm going to just deal and rock with that. What are you doing? Breastfeeding Finley? We just did that. You are going to stuff this baby alive. Put him back. Wait, which crib does he belong in? Okay, there we go. All right, they should be coming anytime now. Like the first guest or somebody. Oh, we got bills to pay already. We just moved in. Oh, that them bills is pricey too. So let's go ahead and pay them bills and see whatever is in the mail. Who is here? Who's the first person here? Alec. Why did you guys bring your, your, your significant others? This house is way too small for all of that. And he's sick. Uh-uh. Silas, take it home. I got infants in the house. I don't want to get them sick. Rylan is here. Um, Quinn is here. Who else is coming? I hope the rest of y'all do show up. Watch Briella be fashionably late. She gives me that type of girl. Um, oh, we got a love letter. I'm not even going to read that because I don't know who that is. And we're happily married. So don't start. Don't start. I seen the little red thing. Rylan, do not start. Oh, Dahlia came along. She should be aging anytime, y'all. She's going to be a teen. I'm excited to see who she's going to like, her mom or her dad. All right, so Jace really wanted to invite over Alec and talk to Alec. So I'm going to have them, you know, talk it out a little bit, catch up on life. Let's applaud and vegetarianism. We are talking about engagements. He's probably asking him, when are you going to get engaged to Silas? Now I'm talking about cats. Let's compliment his cleverness. And, you know, give him a little hug if we can. What are you doing? Okay, she catching up with Quinn, sister-in-law. They're telling jokes and stuff. Let's ask about her day. All right, but we're Sienna and Quentin because we can't we can't age up the triplets until we see the grandparents here for real. I could care less about the others. I just hope they don't bring their other significant others and stuff and friends. Not Flora saying, what's that smell? I know you ain't trying to say Quinn is stinking because she ain't. Who, who put the pancakes at by y'all is reckless. I'm going to be nice and wait until four o'clock to see if Sienna, Quentin and Briella will show up. If not, they're going to miss the triplets aging up. I'm so sorry. They should be here, though. Maybe later. Maybe they're busy. I don't know, but they're going to miss it. Oh, well. And look, they got it. They pooed themselves. So let me have Flora come over here and change Phelan's diaper along with the rest of them. Oh, yeah. Here they go crying. Well, here she is crying. Yeah, handle her. And then we're going to age y'all on up. Maybe I should have had them order a pizza because pancakes, please. It is the afternoon. We need a real meal. I mean, pancakes is a real meal, but I want to see some some pasta, some, some a little something, something, you know. But I guess we're going to be snacking on some cake or whatever. 
Oh, look at Quinn and Felix. She's meeting her her nieces and nephew for the first time. Stop breastfeeding this dang baby. I'm about to put on the wrong crib, but it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. All right, it is 3.39, just a couple more minutes. Oh, I hope you're not leaving. The party just started, girl. Wait, who was that? Who, who the freak? I know they didn't bring me. Why they keep bringing the cats here? And how did y'all get here if Sienna and Quentin ain't here? Unless, unless Quinn brought the cats. I did not see them walk up in here. They're going to cause all this routing problems. Oh, goodness gracious. I'm about to reset them. Yeah, I'm going to reset Benji. I'm so sorry. Y'all do not belong here. Reset Sim. I'm going to only reset you and be nice because the others is outside where they belong. All right, it is 4 o'clock. They're still not here. So, oh, well, I don't know who's closer to who, but we're going to go ahead and block candles for who's the oldest? Finley. Yes. Yes. So, let's go ahead and do that. I feel like Flora is closer to the, yep, 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 yep. Let's get started. <gasps> I should buy a home recorder thing. Let me, let me hurry up and do that real quick. And while I'm at it, I'm going to put these pancakes over here and buy another birthday cake. So I don't have to keep coming into build and buy mode. Where is the video recording thing? It should be under electronics. Um, I want to get the most expensive one so we can have good quality and I need to get the storage thingy thing. Why can I not find anything? Oh, here it is. I ain't got no space to put it anywhere. Maybe we can just throw it out right there. All right. Since Flora has the baby in her hand, I am going to have him record this beautiful moment. All right. Record a moment. No, no, no. You're not going to celebrate, but you are going to celebrate, but you're just going to be recording. All right. All right, here we go. Let me pause the game. Oh, I can't even pause the game. All right, see, record. Y'all, the way my game just crashed, good thing I saved. Oh my goodness. Let's do this again. Record. Re freaking record. I wish I was able to pause, but we're going to record. Everybody in my way. Hold on. Happy birthday, little one. Can't wait to see what you're going to look like. Okay, let me get over here so I can see you on the floor and watch you age up and stuff. Yo, look at him down here, not up there. Let's get the whole family too. Sienna, Briella, and Quentin still ain't here, but everybody else is still here, luckily, thankfully. And hopefully they stay up until the other babies age up too. I feel like they're gonna leave by then because it's Sunday, they probably gotta work and all that and go to school. So yeah, hurry up and age up, we wanna see. Can I fast forward? I can't, so I'm just gonna stop recording. Oh, there we go, uh, hold on. Oh, goodness, he's so cute. Can I like go on the other side? I can't cause your uncle is in the way. Oh, not you being outside. Okay, let me see what he looks like. Let me see. You're giving your father. I could just tell by the eye color and the eyebrows and the hair color definitely. He is so handsome. All right, next baby. Let's go ahead and celebrate for the other boy. I'm sorry, I, forget, I keep forgetting their names y'all. It's so many of them. I'm gonna have him go ahead and crawl away so there's not any like bad routing problems. So it looks like Jace is gonna get baby boy. So I'm gonna pass the camera to Miss Flora. Oh, what's in the way? Oh, y'all are in the way. Hold on, I think I might have to delete this and put this here and move y'all just a little bit. Thank you. And let me turn my cheats off too, because I don't want nothing crazy happening. Okay, there we go. All right, so do it again. No, not the risky woo-hoo. We gotta hurry up and get this done before everybody leaves. So get them. Sorry, y'all gotta move out the way. All right, what are you doing, Flora? Oh, I hope you weren't breastfeeding. Okay, you were just rocking in the chair. Let me give you the camera. And I'm gonna have you record. Not celebrate. All right, here we go. We got a we got a decent angle. We recording. All right, period. Let me just move her a little bit. Yes, happy birthday to the second born. Oh, that music is thumping. The camera's about to die, but I, I'm hoping it doesn't just die on us. What are you looking at? 
He's like, please let these babies be on their best behavior because I ain't got time. Where's the other little one at? Oh, he's long gone. Yes! Hurry up before this camera die. Let me get you on the floor too. Cutie. Hurry up now. Let me get everybody else too. Ooh, let me zoom out. There we go. Dang, we could barely see Dahlia. Oh, there go your sibling, the firstborn. Any day, little one. Come on, Felix. I swear Felix was the first one born, but it could have been Finley. Because sometimes my portrait panel gets the, the triplets and twins mixed up and stuff. So I don't know. I might have to fix that later on. But I think I got them right in the right order. Yay. Oh, are you guys all like identical? He has ginger hair too. And I think I see green eyes. Ooh, not you trying to walk. Ooh, what color eyes you got? Gray, just like your dad. Let me turn this rodeo down to low. And for the last baby, come on, let's get Phelan. Y'all all gotta move for real. I get we excited and we all want slices of cake, but we do not care about no cake. All right, last baby, Phelan. Let's go get Phelan. Okay, Jace is gonna get her. So Flora is gonna record again. And don't even think about eating. And not y'all fighting. Don't start. Let's be on our best behavior. Okay, record this one too. Last one, last one. I know there's a lot of kids going on. Happy birthday, baby girl. The only girl. It's given like the OG triplets. Look at him. He just, okay, now he's not looking up in the sky anymore. He's just looking at whatever it is. All right, let's see if the babies are around. Okay, he's trying to learn how to walk. He's determined. I don't know where the other one is. But we got the whole fam here. He's about to put her on the floor, so let me go ahead and go over here. Ooh, child, that's a wall. All right. Happy birthday to... No, we got to sing the remix. Happy birthday to ya. Hey, happy birthday. Y'all just all walking in the way. And I see flies and stuff. Oh, it's giving ghetto. <laughs> oh, goodness. I hope she looks like Flora. Because the boys are looking like Jace, which no problem with that. But I want this one to look like Flora. Oh, she's a ginger too. Oh my goodness, they're all identical. I see she has blue eyes. Wait, hold on, who has blue eyes? Oh, Flora has blue eyes, I forgot. She's a cutie. Oh. All right, so I went ahead and gave the triplets makeovers. Ignore the boys being shoeless if you see their feet. The smooth patch glitches with toddlers and create a sim, so I have to add shoes on them later. But when I took the triplets into create a sim, they don't look very identical. However, they all have the same hair color. I love how they have different eye colors, but I noticed that Phelan and Felix look more alike. Hold on, let me see if I can show y'all. Okay, so here's Phelan. She has like this interesting shape nose, which I'm pretty sure she gets from her father and lip shape. She's hiding, but let me show y'all Felix. Felix, what are you doing, babes? You are in the trash. I wanna show the people what you look like. And people are starting to leave, which is fine. Cause we have to switch over to the other OG triplets soon. See, they have the same nose shape and lip shape and eyebrows. And surprise, surprise, Phelan is imaginary toy friend. She's part human and she can turn into an imaginary toy friend, which obviously she gets from her mother. And then the boys are human, which is pretty cool. So let me zoom in on him since I zoomed in on those two. He looks a lot like his dad. I gotta say Felix and Phelan look more like their mother. I mean, Vice versa. Felix and Phelan look like their father and Finley looks like his mom. There we go. That's what I meant to say. All right. So are y'all all leaving or am I just having a bunch of routing problems? I can't hear the music anymore. So I'm going to go ahead and change the station. Don't blast my ears. Okay. So y'all need to eat. So eat this slice of cake and then we need to clean up a little bit. So let me drag this over here. I typically don't have y'all eat cake, but I'm going to be nice tonight. Okay. She's not hungry anymore. So let me go ahead and toss this cake in the trash. Or let me go ahead and delete it since it wants to act weird. Listen to story. Oh, she must be telling a, a, a ghost story. But we don't even like being outside. So let's go ahead and come indoors. Let me teleport you in here. What's the strut? 
I think that's with her being an imaginary toy friend. I don't know. But, um, what's her face? Dahlia, you better head home soon. I'm pretty sure your mom is looking for you, and it's a school night. All right, she wants to potty train Finley. I'm going to exit out all of that because I, I do want her to buy a potty chair, though. Oh, we need to feed the babies. So when you're done eating, I want you to feed all of them on the floor. They should be hungry. No, it's just her. So, yeah, feed her on the floor. And can you shut up? You can't get in. Girl, let me go ahead and reset you because I ain't about to hear that all night. So that makes it. The party is over. I hope everybody enjoyed themselves. I wish Sienna, Quinta, and Briella did show up, but they could have been busy. Um, yeah. They want to teach the babies how to walk. I just realized he's going stir crazy, but he'll be fine. I don't know what these two can do. Y'all are both in a bathroom together looking crazy. I said feed the baby. All right, you're going to feed the baby. I think to end off Jason Flora, we're going to see them again eventually. But to end off, I think I'm going to have them risky woohoo, not try for baby. Usually I would have them try for baby if they wish to have another kid. But like I said earlier, I don't think it's appropriate to have a kid right now. Um, The baby is outside trying to walk down the steps. Get your tail back in this house. They can barely walk around because these triplets is everywhere. So, yeah, I'm going to have these two risky woohoo since the party is over and they have more privacy. Risky woohoo. If she gets pregnant, she gets pregnant. If she doesn't, they can always try again another time. So, here we go. Knowing these two, I feel like Flora would get herself pregnant, but I'm really hoping it's not another set of triplets or twins. I hope it's a single baby and hopefully they can have another girl because there's only one girl in the house right now. Don't cry. Who's crying? Oh my god, you're giving Briella. You just cry for no reason. Go play with your brothers or go play with a toy. Alright, they're in the bed. Come on. Yes, yes, let's get to it. Let's get to the nitty gritty. They have a lot of good wishes, but I already have some locked in that I want to keep. They're pretty I'm pretty sure they're gonna wish for it again soon, so I'm not gonna stress. You really want to talk to your brother. But I am going to lock in Teach and Phelan how to walk because you have an empty spot versus Flora. All right. So here they are. Risky Woohoo went at 50%. Yes, I know it's high, but it's because I have the birds and the bees mod. So we'll see in a few sim days or whenever the triplets, the OG triplets, come back from university to see if they're having another baby. I feel like they aren't, but knowing me and my luck in this game, they're going to have another one. It is currently the next following day, a Monday morning. The triplets are doing their own separate things right now. And like I mentioned earlier, I told you guys that Dahlia should be aging up pretty soon. And she aged up. She is a beautiful teen. Ignore how she looks now because I'll give her a makeover off camera. But right now, Rylan is stopping by to wish her a happy birthday before heading off to university today. She should be in school, but I think this is a perfect time to take her out to breakfast or anywhere she wants so that he can express his love and care for her before he leaves town. Look at them and let me zoom in on her so y'all can see what she's looking like she is definitely looking like rylan she has his eye color the lip shape the nose shape everything she looks nothing like her mother she actually looks like the female version of rylan when he was a teen believe it or not she just needs a little fixing all right so they're a little bit caught up on life and stuff which is great so i am going to take her out to breakfast um hopefully she's a breakfast type of person because that's the only place we're going because we got other things to do now i would take them to go see a movie but the movies start later in the day yeah 5 p.m and he's definitely not going to be in town by then so let me see if i can find like the most fanciest restaurant we have one over here but that's kind of far and they don't have a car right now which i don't know where the car is it could be in one of the other siblings inventory so we're just going to walk down the street and come down here eat here it opens up at 11 a.m hold on how about this other place Wait, I didn't even know they had like hours, but that's realistic. Yeah, it's for everywhere. So I guess like we can like chill it out, rock out at her mom's house. Her mom is here. I'm surprised he, she even let him in because it was a struggle to get in here. All right, now they're best friends, which I think you guys already had a pretty decent bond before, but it's even stronger. So that's really, really good. I'm gonna let you guys keep talking it out. Maybe you can tell her a funny story and an inside joke. Uh, let me see what Sky's up to. Yeah, she is not in the house, so she's minding her own business because if she was in the house seeing Rylan talk to their daughter, she'd be pretty, pretty angry right now. So, yeah, let me leave her alone. I'm not even going to interact with her. 
Because then she's probably going to be like, get out. You don't belong here. Now you're trying to say your daughter stinks. All right. Maybe you guys can. We're not going to teach her how to drive. Because like I said, we don't have the car nor have the time. Maybe you could like make a promise to protect her. Like I'll always be there for you. Even though, you know, I'm not here. I don't have custody of you. But one day I would love to have custody of you because your mother is crazy. All right. Just 30 more minutes left. Maybe we can like watch TV or something. I don't know. She really loves her dad. She said, you're my BFF. Anything for you, love bug. And this dusty dog still exists. Cashew. Let me stop chewing that dog up. That could be Dahlia's dang dog. All right. It is almost 11 a.m. Let me see what these fools is doing. Okay. She's sketching. He's doing laundry. And look, look, look. Alec is drunk with his alcoholic self. He needs to seek therapy. That's, that's one thing I'm going to do when they leave university. Not right now. All right, it is about that time for them to head off to the restaurant. So let me go ahead and do this. Eat with others. I should have them form a group. Hopefully it automatically does it like any other day when I don't ask for that. Oh, shoot. Sky walking in. Hurry up and bounce. Let's hurry up and leave. Wait. Let me form this group real quick with her. Because she is not getting up. Dahlia finally got up. I don't know what was taking her so long, but they are now on their way to the restaurant. Ignore her outfit. I don't know what the freak she got on. It's the shirt for me. The skirt is cute. Not the color, but that shirt got to go. <laughs> Who stinks? Who stinks? What are y'all doing? What are y'all doing? You guys have the closest bond in this house. Why are we fighting? Give Briella. Bye. Y'all remember in season one when <laughs> Briella was being a jackass to Alec and Alec wanted to give her what she deserves. He's doing it again. Maybe you should. Don't be nice to her. How about you like argue with her and insult her? Like, girl, I am not the one to be messing with. You've been picking on me for the longest and I'm going to stand up for myself. Stand my ground a little bit. And she might try to fight him back. But we'll see what happens. Let's focus on these two. Oh, they're going to eat lunch, brunch, whatever you want to call it. Maybe you guys can stay for not dessert, not dessert. <laughs> We're just going to stay for lunch, brunch, whatever you want to call it. She says she's tired. Can y'all? Oh, my gosh. Now they're acquaintances. Briella really ruins stuff for real. This is one thing I don't like about her. That diva trait is something else. Oh, you guys are making up. Oh, Briella, why don't you go ahead and apologize to him? Well, since you can't do it, how about you compliment his cleverness? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. And give him like a hug. Well, not another hug, but like applaud his vegetarianism. Something. You was just just so mean. Let's lock that in. We want to be friends with him again. Y'all, look at Alex Moodlet. It says accidental compliment. What seemed like a backhanded and venomous compliment turned into a sweet and complimentary. Alec is very confused on how that happened. It's my first time seeing this Moodlet. That's crazy. It's like when he complimented her, he's like, I'm regretting it now since you want to act like a biatch. Like, what? All right. Let me let me see if I can get them to be friends again since, um, what's his face? Rylan is still out with his daughter. Gossip. Okay, let's see what you guys going to gossip about. She's like, I really don't want to gossip. All right, that's enough interaction. She's getting on my nerves. She, oh, that's even worse. <laughs> I, I can't do anything right now to make them. Yeah, no, 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 no. Yeah. Let, let's, let's take away. Let's take a break. How about you guys like watch TV or something? Maybe you can. Uh oh, he got a new mood lit. Foot in the mouth. Alec tried to say something nice, but it just came out all wrong. That's because he's socially awkward. Oh, I feel bad. How about you talk to your boo thing on the phone? Tell him how you're feeling. Like, oh, not invite over, but tell him, yo, my sister, she's trying to gang up on me for real. And I don't know what to do. I need some advice. And then she's just going to watch some TV because she talks to Giovanni enough as it is. And he could be working right now. So, yeah, but we could text him. Do you like a little friendly text? Nothing more because I don't want him coming over. When your food arrives, it isn't what you ordered. Do you kindly send it back or do you keep it, eat it up? Send it right back? The freak. Listen, if I'm paying for it, I'm going to send it back. All right, well, it looked like they apologized. And I think he's going to get like a free. No, he didn't. But they're almost done eating. So let me go back to these two. 
What took five simoleons? Who's this? She's kind of pretty. All right, any day now. Oh, look, there's Giovanni speaking of the devil. I wonder what he here for. All right, Dahlia girl, you gonna come out? I'm gonna tell her to go to school or is it, mm, it's not worth it because it's almost two o'clock and high schoolers get out at two. All right, maybe she's staying a little longer for drinks or a dessert, but I'm gonna have Rylan go ahead and go home. Actually, there she go. I wanna say goodbye to her. Like give her like another farewell hug and you know, happy birthday, enjoy your day. I think her birthday technically was yesterday, but you know, happy belated birthday. All right, let's give her a farewell hug. It was nice spending time with you, my love. My dearie. Aw, see you soon. I'm gonna get this edumacation. There we go. See, I would have the triplets say goodbye to the whole family, including their mom and dad, but it was so hard getting a hold of them um, in the first part or the second part. And they're working right now, so I don't got time to wait. I really want them to go to university as early and as soon as possible because it is the afternoon already. Yeah, you want to become friends with Alec. You wishing it multiple times. You must feel real guilty of what you did. Take a shower with Flair. You only know dang shower. All right. Rylan is on his way back home, so I will see you all in university. We are finally back in university. I know I told you guys that for the second term, I will let the triplets go off and get a house off campus, but I decided not to do that because they're not in a financial place to pay rent for a house. So they are back in their dorms living rent-free, which is what we love. Save money, live better. Currently, the boys are playing juice pong, getting drunk already. It looks like Rylan is tipsy, and I'm not surprised if Alec is tipsy too. Catch up on old times. That'd be so cute. Let's see what Briella is doing. Briella is on her cycle, so she's having really bad cramps. So I wouldn't be surprised if she start cussing everybody out, having her little mood swings and stuff. But I just love how she's on one of her brother's bed. I think that's, um, whose bed is this? I think that used to be Alex's bed. But let me go ahead and set these ownerships again so that nobody comes up in here and sleep in a bit and they start a fight in. This was Rylan's bed. And Briella's room is over here. I might give their bedrooms makeovers, like on a stream or something. Maybe this Friday. I don't know. Let's turn those radios off. I hate how the the roommates turn on all the radios on the lot. It's insane. Okay, I think that was all of them. Okay, what does she want to do? Talk to Denise. We might have new roommates, by the way. I just peeped that since it's like a whole new term, like a fresh beginning. I'm excited because I'd never seen you before. I don't even know how to say his name. And who are you? That got to be a professor because you you looking a little too old to be uh, in a dorm. But hey, who am I to judge? You're getting your education. I remember Tiberius because Rylan fought him. Oh, I forgot Rylan has like a little boo thing on campus. Let's see if they can like go out somewhere and catch up on old times. Reach level eight of charisma skill. I didn't even know you were at level eight. You're level six. I didn't mean to say eight, my bad. All right, enough talking. I want to see if Asmala, I mean, not Asmala, dang, Asala wants to head out and do something. Let's see if you guys can like go to the coffee shop. She might still be in the same dorm as him, but I, I think every new term there's new people. I could be wrong because I did see someone familiar. All right, she's down to hang out. The rest of these people, these fools, these triplets don't have any love interests, but hopefully they do all one day, except for Alec, because Alec is in a committed relationship. Briella, I don't really see her being with Giovanni for the rest of her life, so I can, you know, see her having a little fling on campus. Maybe this semester, that'd be cool. Maybe she can get like with one of her professors. Who's this? Wine about life. It's a plant sim here. His name is Shay. Let's see what he look like. And be nice to her, even though she's going to whine to you about her life. He's okay. I wouldn't, like, get with him or anything. Her social is pretty low, so I'm going to let her talk to him for a bit. But there's, like, nobody here. Maybe not everybody arrived yet. So I think what I'm going to do is have Briella and Alec head to the student union. I think there's going to be one anyways, but I'm going to have them be there hours early, because why not? All right, let's see if Rylan is here. Oh, look at them flirting already. Well, not flirting, but chatting. Oh, that's a surprise. Briella wants to be friends with that plant, Sam. I don't know. 
I don't know about that one. <laughs> yes, let's ask about her day and um, mm -hmm, catch up on old times. I want to give her a makeover. I do, I do, I do. Um, and things about comic books. Maybe she's down with that. I want to see if she's still attracted to him. Because it's been a minute since we've seen you, girl. Being quite handy as dandy. Well, yeah. Start a standard protest. Ooh, see, Briella had a protest in a, a couple parts ago. But I can see you starting one, too. Oh, no. Oh, I thought he was about to fight somebody. Not that I'm talking about engagement. I hear somebody dumpster diving. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that's Connie. All right, maybe y'all can, like, come on in and get a drink or get a snacky snack. But I do want them to, like, flirt if she allows us to. If you give her a kiss, did she respond to his... I don't care what anyone else thinks. I think you're hot. Um, that is so disrespectful. <laughs> Wait, and she stinks, too. Like, girl, get out of here. Uh-uh. Here, play pool with your brother so you don't cuss that girl out for flirting with you. Like, we don't know you. All right, Asala, are you going to take this kiss? I'm assuming she's still attracted to him, so there's no worries here. All right, give her a hug and give her some flowers, like a romantic red. She's trying to get down and dirty, but girl, we just got here. Give it some time. And then maybe take a romantic photo together and then we're going to go in here and get a drink. His hunger is fine, but we came here to see you and also to get a drink. I can see him getting an energy drink. Maybe he should get like the watermelon mushroom cloud. Yeah, that seems cool. I don't think Asala liked that romantic photo. Maybe the photo was ugly or maybe she didn't. She wasn't down for another kiss. I don't know. But oopsie. Hopefully their relationship or bond didn't decrease. I mean, it's never been really high. So Ooh, let me turn these lights on. It's kind of dark in here. Uh, lights. Listen to complaint. Can y'all stop telling y'all business and problems to us? Because we surely don't care. And go get this drink. And you better drink it too for five simoleons. Or however much it was. Nine? Yeah. Oh, he ball hit it. Oh my goodness. I'm cracking up. Yeah, go ahead and drink that. Get over this little tipsy bootleg you got here. I don't think it's going to help, but yeah, let's drink this. I know you're not going all the way upstairs to drink that. Or is it really busy up in here for him not to drink downstairs? This is where everybody is at. The cafe. Cracking up. Well, dang, forget the drink. It's time for the meet and greet. So Alec and Briella are there nice and early. So we don't got to worry about anything. All right. She's getting this stuff done. I want you to talk to your professor if your professor is here. And you too. Get to know your professors because last semester we didn't even see any of the professors here. It was given unprofessional. No professors were available to chat. Well, how about for you? And who is your professor this time? Yours is a girl. Okay, we definitely can't like try and get with our professor because Brilla is straight. But her name is Denise. Your professor is Lewis. And your professor is Norm. So they're all different professors this time. Or at least I think. Yeah. Give a lecture about athletic. Okay. These two are chatting it out. Um, see if your professor is here, Rylan. Talk to your professor. I highly doubt. You know, I'm not even gonna waste your time. But I am gonna have you get a university poster, and she can get like a candy bar. And here he is, minding his own business. I'm not even gonna stop him. <laughs> Or actually, I should stop him because I want him to get more into this medical stuff. Of course, it's in use. Research sample. I'm going to kick somebody off. I'm going to kick the mascot off in research science. Yeah, we're going to do that. Have eight friends. Oh, that's pushing it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Apologize. My goodness. She got on my nerves. It's dark in here, too. Let me turn on all these lights. Turn on all lights unless at the intensity. Oh, shoot. That's that's bright enough. Never mind. And let me see how many classes they have this semester. It should be less because they're only taking 12 credits. All right. Class schedule. So they have four classes each. Mm hmm. Monday through Friday. 
I would read all that, but you guys see it for yourself. I think it's the same for all of them. Yeah, they each have four classes. Not bad, not bad. Become friends with Briella? We'll try. She's she's not feeling it today. She's cramping. Oh. Here, 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 here. Oh shoot. Never mind. Alright, um, wrong person. I'm getting confused. <laughs> Talk about art. Yeah, that's good. She likes art, so that's that's good. Not the fight. How about you? Hmm. Smooth recovery? I don't know what that is. Is it like another way of apologizing? Maybe talk about rebelling. She's like, boy, I really don't care. I'm cracking up. Briella is <laughs> one interesting sim. I am going to end this part right here. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. And I will see you all in the next part. Bye, everyone.